Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please remember to take what resonates. Don't take the rest. Okay. So we have the Star Energy and the Eight of Wands. Somebody loves you and they want to transform a relationship it looks like. We have the Ace of Cups and the Death card. Somebody wants to make something right here. Give you a wish. Some kind of wish come true. Oh, this is going to be a shocker. So, the challenge here is you're going to be shocked. Because this person might have cut you off. Or they might have seemed cold to you at one time. But they're coming in with bells on to express their love to you. And I think it's going to be some kind of a... Yeah, this is going to be a surprise. Most recent past. Yeah, somebody acted very hasty here. In the most recent past with the, the Knight of Swords... The Eight of Pentacles and the Eight of Swords. Perhaps they were stuck in another relationship or stuck in another situation that, you know, they tried to work out. Or this was something that had to do with work. I feel like somebody travels a lot here. Maybe that's what they do for a living. And maybe they were just concentrating so much on work that they didn't think about a relationship. And, and, and if, if this isn't you, please, you know, disregard it. But if it, if it is you, and it's somebody that, you know, you're interested in, I do feel like it's new. With the Page of Cups, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Eight of Swords, this person has, has some financial constraints because possibly there are children involved. Uh... They definitely have some kind of financial constraint here. They're trying to resurrect their finances, or perhaps that's you. Taking a leap of faith. I do feel like it's somebody else, though, Scorpio. Factors affecting the situation. Three of Wands. Waiting for your ships to come in. Waiting for something to be over. Now this could be the other person who got betrayed in the most recent past. And they, they might be coming to offer you some kind of apology because I feel like what they did to you was done to them. Some kind of betrayal. Some kind of ending. Maybe they left you on hold and you didn't, you know, with the, with the three of wands. You didn't know where this person was coming from. Now you do. Yeah, they're coming to tell you the truth. Cancer energy. Ace of wands. They're coming to be honest with you about something. <clears throat> Could be a king of pentacles. They're definitely going to be honest about their, their financial situation. And, and if they ask you for money, don't give it to them. I'm just going to say that. I mean, a lot of people out there uh, struggling and a lot of people out there stealing. So don't let somebody take advantage of you. If they need a little help, you know. Maybe give them a little help, but that's on. That's up to you. So we have the Queen of Pentacles as the hopes and fears. They're hoping that you're going to say yes. A Virgo energy here with the Six of Swords. This person's definitely coming towards you. Like I said, they're going to shock you with some kind of an apology and the truth.
Devil energy. Final outcome. They're still in a relationship. That this is this, but they're obsessed with you. That that's what they're coming to tell you. It looks like is that they're still in a relationship and they're trying to get themselves single, but it ain't happening fast enough for this person. They're totally obsessed with you. Totally wanting to be in your life and transform a situation they're trying to get themselves single because we had the king of pentacles and the queen of pentacles um, they're giving you some kind of option but this person could be in the limelight They got played. They got played hard. World card. And and whatever whatever happened to this person, it is coming to a close. Like I said, whatever they did to you was done to them. And whether you decide to entertain this person or not, that's you know, that's up to each and every one of you. But you're not sure if you want anything to do with this person because of the way that they treated you. Whether or not, I, you know, I mean, I, I do feel like this person is coming. They're coming towards you, High Priestess. And I think you feel this. I think you know this. I think you know that they've been watching you. And whatever, I mean, online, because it's about the only way that they could probably watch you if you're not in contact with this person. Six of Pentacles and the and the, and the Page of Swords they could even be stalking you online. I, I can't even say they're not because of the, the, the obsession that they have with you. They do want to come and tell you the truth, though. So, I mean, you might want to hear them out. Look at this tower again in the Two of Cups. They see you as the one all be all. They're healing. They're Two of Cups. What they truly want. And they know that somebody got in the way here. Or they got in their own way. They want to put these burdens down and fix it. Like I said, I, I do feel like this person's legit, Scorpio. They have experienced their own tower. And they got played. And they got played hard. By whoever they chose here. Or this could be a new relationship where this person is a little gun shy. But in love with you and obsessed with you. Because of what just happened to them. They do want to fix some form of, uh, of a communication and relationship here though with you. This could be a child. This could be, you know, a cousin. This could be a sister, a brother. You know, somebody wants to fix something with you. Equal give and take. I do feel like it's romantic though. I mean with the tower coming out here twice as the challenge and the two of cups and the knight of cups. Yeah, I do feel like this is romantic. <clears throat> this could be somebody that you're already with that you might have just gotten into a fight with over somebody else. I don't know. Everybody's, everybody's situation is going to be different. That's why it's a general reading. Five of swords to the six of wands yeah big old fight 
Somebody wants to apologize for this big old fight. Somebody just, the, who, whoever this third party was, whoever this person was that was involved, they just wanted to win. They didn't love your person. They didn't, they didn't love this person. They just wanted to win. And, and in the immediate future, you may be fighting along their side because, like I said, they got tricked. They got duped. They want a brand new beginning with you. They're willing to fight for this. They're willing to do whatever it takes to be with you. That is something that comes around every day, Scorpio. So, you know, I mean, take, you know, I mean, you were waiting on this. You, you were literally waiting on somebody to rock your world like this and, and and they're rocking it they're rocking it king of wands collaboration and the ace of cups again they're in love with you they want to work something out You're going to get a message from this person, I'd say by this month, because we got the death card and the tower twice, the death card twice, yeah, definitely towards the end of the month when Scorpio season starts, probably around your birthday, I don't know why I'm getting that, but it's something that has to do with your birthday or October 31st, I don't know why I'm getting that, but I'm getting that. Yeah, this person wants a brand new beginning. And it is something that you've been waiting for. Something you stood in your nine of wands for. You defended your truth. You defended your integrity. And this person is now seeing, <clears throat> seeing that for what it is. Yeah, somebody got ghosted here for the risky behavior. Two of Wands, and they chose a player. They know they chose a player. They chose a good time, not a long time. Now they're all left out in the cold and feeling lonely and, you know, like they ain't got nothing to offer. This person feels like they ain't got nothing to offer. But they're going to tell you the truth. And maybe that's enough to, you know, even if even if you don't want anything to do with this person, maybe it's enough to, to put you at ease, your peace of mind. So we have the sun here. Something be being lit up. Something being shown from the darkness. Like I said... There's an apology coming for either, and I feel like they might have ghosted you for a player. Maybe it was something short-lived. Maybe this wasn't like, like say you were dating them and then all of a sudden they disappeared. And now they're back telling you that they're in love with you and obsessed with you. I mean, it is what it is, y you know, you, you can walk away from this or you can choose to give it a shot because this person, I, I do feel like they're sincere, Scorpio, Virgo, Capricorn and Aries energy, Leo too. Is there a third party? Well, yeah, there's still a third party in the, in the mix. But I feel like they're attracted to you. They're not attracted to this third party anymore. They're passing judgment on them. Because perhaps the other person had other people. You know, I mean, this looks like somebody who wanted to 
have their cake and eat it too. They wanted your person and they wanted anybody else that they wanted. I don't know how you feel about that, but, you know, like I said, everybody's got their own thing. Yeah. So, all of this partying and hanging out with these people and all this, it cost them, cost them big time. In fact, somebody was doing some magic on them, trying to get them to spend all their money on them. Out of, out of some form of I feel like whoever this person was that they got involved with is very very materialistic that's all they cared about was the money so they kept playing and kept playing and kept doing uh, you know magic on this person but the tower is coming down and they're realizing who they really love and it's not it's not this group of people they're going to block the devil. They're going to block the magic. And they're hoping that you will accept them into your life. They're willing to fight for you. And put the devil down. Hmm. They're ready to release this. They're completely overburdened by it. Like I said, Eight of Wands, Page of Swords. This party of people are, are, are stalking and watching this person. Everything that they do, everything that they say. Like, like, uh, like they're part of some elite group or something and Two of Swords. They realize who you are. They were confused. They were overburdened by the devil. This is what they're coming to tell you. This could even be some form of an addiction. Or a mother. A mother maybe that had a little too much uh, power over them. Tried to get them to go with this other person. And like I said, it could be a family thing, you know, where, like in some cultures, they betroth people to other people because of their class or status or whatever. And maybe this person got themselves stuck in that situation and they got totally played by the person that they were supposed to be with. So I got change for the Queen of Swords, the Ace of Swords, and the Nine of Wands. Something's changing. Something big is changing for you, Scorpio. With the Tower here twice, now we got the Two of Cups again with the Emperor. This is a Divine Masculine who feels like, it feels like they're taking back their power so they can have their feminine, so they can have their, their powerful counterpart. And it looks like there's an awful lot of water under the bridge. Cancer energy, Capricorn energy again. The devil. This person does not want you to be single. They, they want to be with you. Here comes the apology from the devil on their chariot with the Two of Cups. That's the third time I've got the Two of Cups here. With the Emperor and the Empress as the outside influence on the bottom of the deck. There's something big happening here. Lots of truths coming out. I mean, with, with the sun on the five of pentacles. Yeah, there's lots of truth coming out here. Obligated. This person was obligated to money. Because of possibly a child in the family. And a community of people. Like I said... This could be a belief system that this person was involved in because of a family situation. Now, in some cultures, uh, I'm just saying, this could be somebody who's from a completely different culture than you. 
So in some cultures, like I think it's Filipino, where their sons are obligated to take care of the mother and the father and, and the family when they grow up. That could be what this is all about. Look, we have the child, the family room, and community. We got pathway expectation of a mother, of, of, of a mature woman. Somebody expected somebody to take care of them and a whole family. So like I said, this person may have money, but they, they may have left you out in the cold because of the belief system that they were under due to family, a family lineage. And maybe they changed their mind and then maybe they want to be with you now. They don't want to, they don't want to have to deal with this anymore. <coughs> I need a drink. Separation, sadness, missing you, thinking about you. Talking, interested, conversing more, awaited message arrives, text, call, email. Mirroring each other's, mirroring each other's self-image. Relationships reflect our wounds. Heartbroken, this person is definitely, definitely broken. And they're afraid this relationship's over and there's not going to be a second chance. And there might not be. But there is a soul connection and a partnership and agreement here. That they know they broke it. But can they fix it? I think that's going to be up to you, Scorpio. It's not going to be up to them. It's going to be up to you. Like I said, listen, listen, hear them out. Hear what they got to say because, like I said, they are obligated to a belief system that maybe you don't understand. And they do, they want to be with you. They, 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 two of cups, two of cups, two of cups, three two of cups. They feel like you are their match. Whoever this person they were with. They do not feel that they were their match. And I do feel like this is somebody's somebody's family that they're obligated to. We have wisdom, material and spiritual changes. Moving on. Coming out of solitude. Finding their power and speaking on it with this angelic presence of the temperance and the universe is fulfilling a wish of a memory of love can't even make it up I, I'm not even going to touch on that any further because I do feel like this is this is like a coming together of two different cultures and two different belief systems and trying to make things right with you because they want you over everything. And the universe is leading them back to you. So. It is in your hands. It is your decision. We got the mother of life in the dark healing chamber. It says the most challenging task is to take courage in both hands. And journey within to meet our own dark self. And begin the healing task of bringing love acceptance and light to it the sacred purpose of any enemy within or without is to push us to venture inwards to seek and heal the darkness within i think i got that for the general too then we got mother of life when life seems dry depleted filled with repetitive tasks or simply stagnant and, and stifled isis the mother of life holds the ability to revive even the most numb, resistant, and difficult circumstances in your life. She calls to you now, seeking to bestow the gifts of life upon you. Be bold and brave and open your arms to receive. I can't tell you what to do here, Scorpio. 
But I can tell you that whoever this person is, they are very sincere. And they're sorry. It's up to you whether you want to deal with them anymore or not. I got 666 and 2111 right in front of me. And 555. So there is some kind of change taking place. It's up to you whether you want to entertain it or not. Or, you know, hear this person out. I do feel like you... Maybe you need to hear this person out and let them at least explain to you what happened here. Because they are in love with you and they are sincere. And that right there is kind of rare. Their relationship with the other person is over. And it's not going to stop this belief system probably because they have a belief system that they have to take care of their family or something like that. They want you to be part of it. Alright. Those are your messages. Please remember to press the like button. Subscribe and share my lovelies. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.